and Ole Miss has one of the best running games that you are, you are going to witness. Leading rushing team in the SEC, Rebels won the toss, elected to receive. Yeah, thick lower body, I know that really caught our eye with his overall size. Gauntlet time, flings it, passes caught. That's a first down to Malik Heath, the Mississippi State transfer, and a gain of 18, Greg. Shot in a quarterback. Bear Morton also on the field for the first time. And the pass is going to be picked off. Intercepted two yards deep in the end zone by Trey Washington. With the throw in the end zone, Trey Washington, hey, right there to stop. Judkins in the backfield, the SEC Newcomer of the Year. The head to ah. no real estate, and down he goes. Penetration, Miles Cole says hello. And Miles Cole come up big for the Red Raiders. He just wins inside position, the penetration, and then the finish to give Texas Tech the ball in great field position. Jumbo set with Morton in motion. He moves under center. They snap it between his legs. Shuck's got the touchdown. Well, that's one way to do it. Gets to Shuck. That is unbelievable. That's good stuff. Rebels have turned it over on fourth down each of their first two possessions tonight. Evans in the backfield. The Houston native. Time for Dart. Has a man wide open and a chunk play for Ole Miss. It's D. Wade, Dayton Wade, the Western Kentucky transfer, and a gain of 37. I think that makes a big difference for the Rebels' rushing attack. Stay with the hot hand. Evans towards the end zone for the touchdown from eight yards out. A little home cooking, it feels better back at H-Town. I mean, you put it in the microwave, got it, got it cooked in a hurry. A lot of weapons in this game for both sides. In the backfield, at running back and at wide receiver. And a big gainer on the way for the Red Raiders. Taj Brooks shoved down. The block by Baylor Cup on the outside. Kind of clears an opening for Taj Brooks, who patiently. As the incompletion forces fourth down and nine. And Wolf gives Texas Tech the lead. Lane Kiffin. Going to dial it up again here on fourth down. But showing eye formation and play action. Dart's going to heave one deep. Double coverage. Intercepted. It's a great play, but you're just hoping for him to drop it. Pressure on Jackson Dart, but this is almost like a punt. Demershin should have just batted that one down. It down and you get the ball back. Ten play of the drive coming up for the Red Raiders. Won their last three games to close down the regular season. Fungi on the screen. He stays in bounds. Finally ushered out inside the five. A lot of movement for Texas Tech up front. Play action for Dart. Pass blocks and it's intercepted. Waters has it. Money Waters. Another big play for the Red Raiders. Who came into this game leading the country in tackles for loss as a defensive back. What happens here with Jordan Watkins? Yeah, just a mix up with by Watkins. He's thinking it's zone coverage for some reason. It is man to man all the way. And his route should have continued. Shuck's going to keep it again. Shot dives in the end zone. And he's got the touchdown. Second score of the night for number 12 in red. And Joey McGuire loves it. They had one scoring drive that went 75 yards in a minute 17 in just five plays earlier in the half. Dart's going to keep it. Ball came out late, and let's see. Boy, he hit the turf hard, and it felt like the ball sprung out just after he hit the ground. No official indication yet. Really on the field is a fumble recovered by the defense. First down. The thing about it is you can't tell if the ground caused it. Maybe. Third down out of the timeout. Pass is caught. That's a touchdown. Jaron Bradley, the freshman, from 12 yards out. Sixth touchdown of the season. All kinds of potential at 6'5", 215. You see a lot of own on there and going for it. 
on fourth downs in your own end of the field like that. That's tough. Junkins trying to break loose. Longest run of the night ahead to the 39 and an 18 yard gain on first down. Second down and 11. Time for Dart. Heaves one deep. Has a man wide open as Watkins. That's a first down into plus territory. Sent out hard to the 32. Zach Evans, the running back. Third and goal. Pocket collapses. Passes. Caught for the touchdown. Jordan Watkins. How big was that for Ole Miss? How big was that throw by Jackson Dart? For his receiver to go make a play. They empty the kitchen sink and bring it. And he's able to get Watkins in the back of the end zone. You've got to stand in there and be willing to take a shot. Every once in a while, every once in a while, I'd get a block in there. First down, tall smiles, Price behind the line, racing ahead, breaks free. Price with a cut. Inside the 30, a gain of 20 yards. Aishim Young checks in to replace Tennyson after the targeting call. Shock is tripped up, and that'll be behind the line, a loss of two more. Come out of there and keep his balance. Pocket closing down. And this being able to, they are able to get to Tyler Shuck with just a four-man rush. Collapsing the pocket. And he tripped up over his center, Dennis Wilbur. Third down and very long. Shuck's going to buy some time. Backside pressure, the ball's out. Who has it? About three different scrums. It was Robinson that forced the fumble. Ole Miss football near midfield. And he tripped up over his center, Dennis Wilbur. Third down and very long. Chuck's going to buy some time. Backside pressure, the ball's out. Who has it? About three different scrums. It was Robinson that forced the fumble. Ole Miss football near midfield. But it needs to come out of your hand. The way you save the possession, and you punt the football on, on fourth down. Here in the second half, the answer is yes. Trying to come back with a vengeance. Dart's going to keep it. Racing for a first down into plus territory. 14 more on the docket for Jackson Dart. Shut flips it. Pass. Caught. And how about that grab? Fungi in traffic. A gain of 16. Utilize a little time. Fake the sweep to Price. Breaking open in the red zone. Inside the one is Bradley. It'll be first down and goal and a gain of 36. Red Raiders moving quickly and that's a touchdown. Thompson. Finley to make a play on it and then they turn right around and go to Thompson. Second down. Wide open. That's another first down. Dayton Wade ball comes out. And Texas Tech has it. Isaac Smith comes up with a recovery. With the extra stuff. He certainly has it. And Smith comes in, gets it out. Not only does he get it. Third down and one, guess who? Tyler Shuck off and running. Racing into the red zone. Brought down to the 12, a gain of 36. The stop by Finley, and he prevented the touchdown. Red Raiders posted that on their social media accounts. I would encourage you to check that out. As uh, Mike Leach certainly we miss for a long time. Good run by Dart, ahead to the 30, and a gain of 22. Approaching the halfway point of the fourth quarter. Dart takes off. Dart diving for the end zone with the flip and the touchdown. Nine-yard run, and that one hurt. It was close. Dart is still down. The losses this year, the common denominator, the turnovers. NC State, Carter Finley Stadium in Raleigh comes to mind. Look at this. Punishing run. Cameron Valdez. 
Nice. Well, the ball came out. Back. This is where you got to make sure. Well, the ball in the field of play. There's no doubt. Went into and through the end zone and over the end line. Result of play is a touchback. First down. Oh, what a play by Battle. One of the Red Raiders, again, that defense is keeping Ole Miss rushing attack in check for the most part. Junkins finds a little daylight. Tripped up crossing the 20, gain of 23. Freshman of the year in the SEC, Dart. Out of the stoppage and a one-handed grab. Front part of the end zone, it was Heath. That's a heck of a catch. How did he make that play? Falling down a one-handed catch. One heck of a grab. Just used his size at 6-3 to kind of fight and freed with freed his left hand up. Oh, that's going to be on a few highlight reels and shows over the weekend. And give me a Sports Center top 10. Give me critical play in a moment where Ole Miss desperately needed it. Still with the chance here. Cruz looking towards his left, now back towards the right. A different approach. Caught cleanly. Off and running and a touchdown for Texas Tech. It was Fudgy. A 44-yard kickoff return for a score. Just about sealed the deal for his team. I mean, heads up play. Nobody in front of him. Just sprint to the end zone. Maybe the easiest touchdown he has in his career. Bang. Four straight wins to close out 2022. Eight and five in year number one. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.